But first, we want to get you back following this breaking news. Chester County Sheriff's deputies investigating after an incident led to a lockdown at a local school. Thanks for joining us here first at four. I'm John Carter and I'm Siobhan Bryan. We're glad you're here. Now this happened around 1230 this afternoon at Great Falls High School. According to the Sheriff's Office, it's what happened after the fight that led to that lockdown. WBTV's Caroline Hicks joins us now live from Great Falls to explain. Caroline. Well, Siobhan, I want to let you know that that lockdown was lifted. Kids were able to be picked up by their parents around 330. But as you mentioned, it was what happened after that uh, fight on campus that led to the lockdown. I'm going to get to that in just a minute, but I'm going to step out of the way so you can see what the scene looks like right now. You can see there are still several law enforcement agencies parked out here just down the street from the high school. Uh, but again, the sheriff's office says uh, there was some sort of of, um, fight on the campus and then after that a group of individuals actually hopped a fence uh, and entered the perimeter of the school and the school resource officer was able to detain one of those people get them in handcuffs pretty quickly right now that person is uh, being questioned uh, and they are continuing to investigate this they also detained one of the students that was involved in that fight but there are still a lot of questions that parents have we spoke with some parents who say of course they were horrified to get phone calls and texts from their kids, letting them know that there had been a fight and that they were under a lockdown. So there's still a lot of questions. This investigation is very much so still ongoing and we'll continue to bring you updates as we get them. You're going to hear from some of those parents coming up at five o'clock. But again, an active situation as they continue to look into what happened. They do want you to know there were some rumors that some shots were fired, but they want to let you know there was no weapon found, no reason to believe there was any shooting. Uh, that's again from the sheriff's office. So we'll continue to bring you updates as we get them. Uh, but again, that's what we know at this point. Reporting live in Great Falls, Caroline Hicks, WBTV on your side. Surely thankful to hear there was no gunfire there.